great tribulation such as was not since the beginning of the world to this time. No, nor either shall be. And except those days should be shortened, there should no flesh be saved, but for the elect's sake, those days shall be shortened. Now it's talking about back then and now it's talking about now. Because the Romans, if they had their way, they would have killed every Israelite that was over there in Jerusalem. Right? But then if any man shall say unto you, Lo, here is Christ, or there, believe it not. For there shall arise false Christ and false prophets. Like the discomforter. The discomforter, when he says he's the comforter, he's really saying that he's Christ. Yep. So it's telling you right there, don't believe that bullshit. Because they were doing it back then 2,000 years ago, and they're doing it today. And shall show great signs and wonders, and so much that if it were possible, they would deceive the very elect. So we we are the elect. That's why we ain't falling for that bullshit, man. But them guys that are following the so-called discomforter, like they were following him back then, they're gonna be destroyed all over again. But behold, I have told you before. Wherefore, if they shall say unto you, Behold, he is in the desert, go not forth. And they're going to start teaching that. They're going to say, oh, the Lord already came, but he's in Egypt. So you're going to have niggas going, taking planes to Egypt to go see the Lord. Go ahead. Behold, he is in the secret chambers, believe it not. Oh, that's what the comforter said. He's in some unknown place. That's a video that he made. You see him walking around. Well, that's the fulfillment of that. Go ahead. For as the lightning cometh out of the east, and shineth even unto the west, so shall also the coming of the Son of Man be. So when the Son of Man comes, he's coming in ships, and he's going to beam us up like the brother said earlier. We ain't leaving out of here no goddamn plane. TWA and United Airlines and all that bullshit. Go ahead. For wheresoever the carcass is, there will the eagles be gathered together. Immediately after the tribulation of those days, shall the Son of Man, I'm sorry, shall the sun be darkened, and the moon shall not give her light, and the stars shall fall from heaven, and the powers of heaven shall be shaken. That's when the missiles drop. Go ahead. And then shall appear the sign of the Son of Man in heaven, and then shall all the tribes of the earth mourn, and they shall see the Son of Man coming in the clouds of, of heaven with power and great glory and he shall send his angels with a great sound of a trumpet and they shall gather together his elect hold up read that again did you hear that and he shall send his angels you mean to tell me the angels are going to become pilots and fly dwa yeah, right. show you how stupid that bubble-eyed nigga down there fucking pulling you man right. go ahead read it loud and he shall send his angels with a great sound of a trumpet and they shall gather together his elect from the four winds of he from the four winds, from the one end of heaven to the other. Now learn a parable of the fig tree. When his branch is yet tender and put it forth leaves, you know that summer is nigh. So likewise ye, when you shall see all these things, know that it is near, even at the doors. Hold on, read that again. And so likewise ye. When you shall see all these things, know that it is near. So all this shit that's happening in the Middle East, Bush got the military down in the Middle East, Bush is getting ready to go down to Iran, but you got this guy Barack Shah talking about, no, go to college, become a doctor, become a lawyer, make it in this fucking society. So that, that shows you that he don't, he don't want this man to go down. He's comfortable. He's comfortable. Go ahead. No. That it is near, even at the door. So this thing is near. If you're thinking that this thing gonna go another 10 years, 20 years, you out of your fucking mind. And you're not of the elect. All right? Go ahead. Thoroughly I say unto you that this generation shall not pass till all these things be fulfilled. So we, we are of that generation. All right? Go ahead. Heaven and earth shall pass away, but my words shall not pass away. But of that day and hour knoweth no man, no, not the angels of heaven, but my Father only. But as the days of Noah were, so shall also the coming of the Son of Man be. For as in the days that were before the flood, they were eating and drinking and marrying and giving in marriage. Right now. All right. Until the day that Noah... Oh, hey, they were going to college, they were becoming doctors and lawyers. Go ahead. Until the day that Noah entered into the ark and knew not a 
until the flood came and took them all away, so shall also the coming of the Son of Man be. Then shall two be in the field. The one shall be taken and the other left. In other words, being up. Go ahead. Two women shall be grinding at the mill. The one shall be taken and the other left. Watch therefore, for you know not what hour your Lord doth come. But now, but know this, that if the good man of the house had known in what watch the thief would come, he would have watched and not and would not have suffered his house to be broken up. So we represent the good man. Go ahead. Therefore, be ye also ready, for in such an hour as you think not, the Son of Man cometh. Who then is a faithful and wise servant? Not the comforter, no. not HODC 12, not Barack Shaw, not even the Daniel 7. Read that part again. Who then is a faithful and wise servant? whom his Lord has made ruler over his household to give them meat in due season. What are we giving you right now? We're giving you meat in due season. This is the meat right here. Go ahead. Blessed is that servant whom his Lord, when he cometh, shall find so doing. What are we doing? We're teaching his word. So we're going to get a blessing. Them guys are going to get destroyed. Especially that motherfucker, the so-called discomforter, man. Go ahead. Verily I say unto you, that he shall make him ruler over all his goods. So we're going to be the ones that's going to be sitting on the top thrones over the rest of Israel. Go ahead. But, and if that evil servant say in his heart, oh, but, that's the comforter, the discomforter, that's HODC 12, that's Nathaniel 7, that's that bubble-eyed fool from, fool from uh, Philadelphia, and the rest of them niggas that's teaching that bullshit. Go ahead. But, and if that evil servant say in his heart, my Lord delayeth his coming. Oh, that's exactly what Barack Shaw said. Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah, he's, cause he's saying, uh, uh, that you, you guys teach that Christ can come next week. That's the mindset you're supposed to fucking yeah, be. Yeah, exactly. What the fuck is wrong with these guys? In the I, I know for a fact. I'm, I'm looking straight in the camera and I'm telling you, Barack Shaw, you're not a man of the Lord and the Most High is going to fucking destroy you, right? Destroy you, bro. But then you seven, you better get your act together. Or the Most High is going to smack the shit out your ass. And, and the discomforter, just enjoy yourself. Just keep doing what the hell you're doing. Matter of fact, give me that in um, Revelation, uh, was it 22? Around about 12? Keep being a devil. Because even if you get right, first of all, you can't get right. You're, you're already marked. You're finished. You're done. Uh, Revelation 22 and 12. This is for the discomforter in HODC 12. 22 and 11. And the rest of you niggas. Go ahead. He that is unjust, let him be unjust still. The discomforter is unjust. Now, if this guy was a comforter of the Lord, you think that all these people can make these videos making mockery out of them, putting them in a fucking chicken soup? Right. And the most I ain't gonna do nothing about it? Right. Go ahead. He that is unjust, let him be unjust still. The, the discomfort is unjust. HODC 12 is unjust. The, the Daniel 7 is unjust. And the rest of them damn false prophets out there are unjust. Go ahead. And he which is filthy, let him be filthy yeah, still. Yeah, keep being filthy. Keep being dirty. Go ahead. And he that is righteous, let him be righteous <laughs> and still. And we are righteous and we're going to remain righteous until the most high come. And in the kingdom, we're going to automatically be righteous. Go ahead. And he that is holy, let him be holy still. And we are the holy ones. And behold, I come quickly, and my reward is with me, to give every man according as his work shall be. So we out here doing the work. So we're going to get a great reward. Now somebody give me uh, Revelation 14 and 1. Uh, 1 Corinthians 15 and 39. I'm sorry, uh, 38. But if any man be ignorant, let him be ignorant. That's, that's plain. You gotta break that down.